morning. Welcome back to Alice with you. Here is Shanghai Station, a metro Changping line in Beijing, China. According to the news, in 2020, Shanghai Station had the third largest passenger volume for entry during morning rush hours. Talking about why Shanghai Station is crowded, we need to check the map first. Here is Wenyu River Valley, and Shanghai is in the western part of the valley. Before 2010, there were only two main roads stretching across Wenyu River, and another alley built on them. The distance between the two roads is more than 10 kilometers, which means many citizens need to spend an extra 20 minutes to detour. At the end of 2010, Changping Line opened to public. Then some people moved to the apartments and town villages near Shanghe Station. And some residents began to take bus to Shanghe Station for metro trip, which causes the overload of the station. During morning rush hours, the queue for metro trains can extend to 100 meters long. And the end of the queue can be found near a gas station. It's 7.36. Let's queue for the metro train. You can see a lot of passengers moving towards the queue. There are even volunteers standing at the entrance of the gas station to keep order. Okay, we finished the left turn. The street is lined with food stands. Before epidemic, a lot of commuters may buy breakfast here than is in the queue. This is not encouraged after Wuhan virus break out in Beijing, and some stands have closed forever. Go the entrance. The escalator is filled with people. Then comes to the useless security check. Another barrier for capacity control. and something goes wrong with my NFT pass or gate system. Try the pass again. This time, pass the gate. It took me 7 minutes to pass it from lining up. And seems I need to say goodbye to the train in front of me. <coughs> Seven forty-six. A second train arrives.
there is no enough space for passengers to line up. So when the doors open, everybody rushed into the train. I would like to wait for the next train, but unfortunately, I was pushed by the passengers behind me. I have no choice. Some passengers cannot get on this train. Gonghua Cheng Station. As Gonghua Cheng is surrounded with rivers, few passengers utilize this station. There is no handrail near the door. Some passengers need to keep balance by holding against the wall. Next is Zhu Xingzhuang, an interchange station to line 8. As Zhu Xingzhuang is the departure of line 8 as well, many passengers choose to transfer here. Since many people will get off, I need to step onto the platform to let them exit first. Life Science Park Station. This was also a crowded station until the surrounded town villages were pulled down by government. CRT Station. Then I take this video. Changping Line has now extended to Chenghe Station, so all passengers get off here. Some of them may exit from CRC station for work, and others will transfer to line 13 for town areas. Can't imagine how they can fit it for 250 days. Tribute to each corporate slaves in Beijing. Okay, here is the end of this video. If you have learned more about commuters in Beijing, please leave a like. And if you like to know more about Beijing, China, welcome to subscribe this channel. Thanks for your time. All the best. Yours, Elliot. See you next time.